Hey there guys, it's Psycho Red here and I wanted to give you guys just a quick video on how to get Playbox HD and Moviebox on your iPhone, iPad, iPod Touch, any iDevice for free without a jailbreak and this is using the iEnchantify method. Um, if you haven't already uh, downloaded iEnchantify, it's a great app. Uh, honestly, it's probably one of the better I think it's probably one of the most stable, more better apps that's out there that allows people to download tweaks. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to have the link below to download the actual iEnchantify app onto your um, iDevice. That way you can you know, download apps, different tweaks and everything. Um, they actually have a new iTunes cards giveaway, so if you want to, you can enter in on their page. They just... Um, if you have a Twitter account, you can link your Twitter account to it and you can send in like tweets and text messages or tweets, excuse me, um, on your page and it will actually enter you in uh, for this contest. So definitely get take a look into that. I'm going to have the, again, the link down below. But let's go ahead and get into it. This is iEnchantify.net and when you go under the app section here, there's a, you know, you can view the different types of packages, meaning the, the different apps that they have, like INDS for iOS, GBA for iOS, different tweaks, um, and there's different sources that they take their, their apps from. But let me um, go into packages real quick, and you can see that they actually have a whole, they have, they have a lot of uh, different tweaks and different apps that you can install onto your iDevice. And the great thing about this site is that they're very current on their uh, on their applications. If something isn't working uh, or if a certificate has been revoked, they'll automatically put something up showing that either something is working, like the INDS for I INDS emulator and the GBA for iOS. So. As you can see, one says working, one says not. So, um, you know, I think this is a, a great app. And the developer who, you know, creates this application and, you know, he does a great job in uh, making sure that these apps are up to date and that everybody knows which you can and cannot install. Uh, so let's go down to Playbox HD. We're going to install that. And with this uh, site, there isn't a. Uh, any sort of time thing that you have to do with your with your um, with your iPhone or with your iDevice, you don't have to switch back the time in any way. You can just download the uh, the the application, you know, just straight from the site. So here's Playbox HD, and we're gonna go ahead and tap on this green button here, and it's gonna ask us to install Playbox. So we're gonna hit install. We're going to back out. That way I can show you that it does work and we're just gonna go ahead and let that wait. All right, so once it's finally downloaded, it, it is a little bit of a lengthy wait when it comes to installing this application. Let me actually move it over. There we go. I'll move it over here. So it is a kind of a bit of a, a lengthy wait when you first uh, get the application. Just hang tight, let it load, it will load, just give it a sec. Now what we need to do is we need to trust the application. So we're going to go into settings, we're going to go to general, and we're going to go to profiles and device management. And let's see here, we are going to go under this one, Shanghai, I'm not even, uh, information and science, we're going to trust that. We can go ahead and click into Playbox, and there you go, and there you have it. So let's go ahead and load up. Um, it's an easy one. Civil War will be an easy one. If you see a new upgrade available, go ahead and just cancel out. Um, but this is. Let's see here. And there you go. There you guys have it. So these apps work great, especially if you do have your if you do have an Apple TV, and you can actually mirror your iDevice to the Apple TV, so you can play it on your big screen. So that's Playbox HD. Let's go and get uh, Moviebox as well. So we'll go back into iChannify. We'll go under Apps, View, scroll all the way down to you see Moviebox. There it is. We'll hit Install.
we'll have you skip this ad. And there you guys have a movie box for iPhone. We're gonna go ahead and click on that. Whoops, there we go. It's, we're gonna go ahead and install, and we'll back out. And you should see it on your main page. Again, go ahead and wait for the application to load. If you notice on the top right, or top left, excuse me, right where my uh, Wi-Fi is at, you can see that, you know, it, the device is thinking that it is, you know, about to load and install this. So give it a sec, it will install. If you do have any problems, come back to this um, uh, to this site and try reinstalling and if not I have uh, also another tweak or another way to show you how to guys how to make your you know applications install for you so uh, I'll be right back once this installs so it finally installed we're gonna go ahead and kick it over to the main page here there we go okay so now that I moved movie box over we're gonna go ahead and tap on it You notice, it, you'll actually, you will notice that I didn't actually have to trust the application to get it to run. Uh, if you come into this uh, situation, don't worry. I'm sure the application is fine, but if you do need to trust it, make sure you go back into general and settings uh, and profile device management and locate your application through, uh, through there. So you will come to this processing uh, box. You can go ahead and close out of this and we'll go under movies. And as you can see, there is a ton of movies that you can download for free without any sort of subscription at all. So a uh, great thing about Moviebox is it gives you like the movie, the actual like logo of the movie, the, you know, what's it about, different movies that you would like if you, you know, do like this movie. And it's just a, it's a great app to have. And then you can also favor them at the top. So uh, with Playbox, you can stream the movie straight off of Playbox and you can run the movie right off of your Wi-Fi. But when you download the movie, uh, you know, it's a lot, I think it's honestly a lot faster. It's more reliable when you've actually had the movie downloaded onto your device, whereas you're just streaming something through your network. So uh, I think Moviebox is more of a fan of when you download the actual movie. You can hit the download button right here and it's in queue here. And when you go back to the main page, you can see under Q that your movie is is downloading, and it will actually start in just a, in just a little bit. But as it finishes downloading, you can actually play it back. And again, this works great off of your Apple TV if you want to stream a movie off your Apple TV. Um, it just works a lot easier when your movie is completely downloaded and it's actually like solid in your device versus trying to stream this off of Wi-Fi. So there's how to download Playbox and uh, Moviebox for free on your iOS devices using iEnchantify. And this is without any sort of date method. You don't need a jailbreak to do this. This is just a simple, you know, go to and download. Uh, these applications do have certificates that sometimes get revoked as well. So just be on the lookout for that. If an application isn't working, it might mean because the certificate has been um, been revoked and it will actually, uh, it won't allow you to download the application from the uh, iEnchantify network. So be on the lookout for that. Uh, I am gonna be, actually, I forgot to mention one more thing. When you go under settings, and if you notice, if you find out that you're, or for whatever reason, if the application isn't downloading and it says unable to download, scroll under Safari, or scroll to, to, you, to you see Safari, excuse me, scroll all the way down to the bottom and clear history and website data. Once you do that, that should allow you to re-download the application again and actually go under Safari too. And if you have any open, you know, um, other open windows, clear those out too restart your device and then it should allow you to download the application without fail so if you have any problems or concerns or questions hit me up here hit me up on twitter or on instagram i'm also available um, you know 24 7 so uh, don't worry if you guys have any sort of questions or concerns or problems i'm right here to help you guys out but this is like red signing off i hope you guys have a good rest of your night